here's your video for the handwriting letter A page. Go ahead and put your name at the top of your paper. And as I do that, I'm going to talk about the letter A. The letter A says, ah, ah. And when she has what's your name E with her, she says her name A. So let's look, let's do this dot to dot. I see a little ant in my picture, but let's see what the ant is on. I'm going to start with the number one. You go to number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Come down, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Now I can see what that is. It looks like a shiny apple. All right, so let's practice writing some uppercase A's, capital A's. They show us with our numbers which way we need to go. So we're going to start with number one as a diagonal down. Pick up your pencil, go back to the top, do a diagonal down this way and cross it right on the midline. Okay, number one is down, diagonal, pick up your pencil, go back to the top, a diagonal down, and hook them together, cross it right there on the midline. Trace all three of those A's, those capital A's, and then I want you to write at least three A's on your own over here. Make sure that your A starts at the top, that you're touching the top line when you're doing your diagonal down and diagonal down and hooking it together. We don't want to waste this space up here and we don't want floaters not touching the baseline. Our capital letters always touch on the top line and the baseline. Then let's practice some lowercase a's. A lowercase a kind of starts out like a letter c. Do you see how number one says to curl around? So it kind of like starts like a c, but I'm not gonna pick my pencil up. I'm gonna keep going and give her a stick that goes straight up and down. So I'm gonna go all the way around, keep going up, give her a little stick on the top and come straight down. Make sure you're taking up all that space between the midline and the baseline. Her head needs to take up that whole space because this is not a good A, because her head's too little. Like a C, start like a C, come up, stick, straight down. Do at least three more A's, lowercase A's on your own. Then we're gonna come down here and trace these lowercase A's. That is the word an, ant, ant, an, apple, an ant, an apple. And it says, what do you see? in the picture. So I'm going to write what I see. I'm going to write a sentence that says I, capital I, see, here's the word see if you need to copy it, I see, and then I'm just going to write an ant, then I'm going to put the word and, and apple. So all those words you need are right there on your paper. I see an ant, those words are right here and right here. Then I'm gonna write the word and, and apple, okay? And, apple. Those both start with that ah sound. Don't forget your period at the end. When you're done, color that ant, and, or you know, I guess the ant's already colored. You can color the apple, though. Make it whatever color apple that you like the best. Maybe like a green apple, or a pinkish colored apple, or red, bright red apple. Color that apple however you would like, and then send a picture of this page to your teacher.